Hey, everybody. It's JJ. Mikey decided to take me somewhere, but I don't know why. Let's ask him. Mikey, what's going on? Don't panic. I just want to give you a little surprise for you. A uh, surprise at the bank? All previous surprises in my life have always been terrible. You're too pessimistic about everything, JJ. It's definitely not going to be bad for you this time. Um, this is all kind of weird. All right, let's go. Why do we have to go to the bank? You probably want to give me a couple cents as a joke. Don't even guess. You'll never guess what awaits you in this building. Come with me. I have a plan. A uh, what? Why can't we go in the front door? Where are we even going? If I tell you about it now, you won't like the surprise. Um, this whole thing just seems too weird to me. I've prepared the tunnel. We need to go through it. You'll see from here. Uh, why do we have to do all this? I hope you're not robbing a bank. Uh, no. This isn't a robbery. It's just another entrance to the bank. Follow me, JJ. Uh, I don't like this. Why do we have to go down a dirty tunnel? Explain it to me already. You got it right. This is a bank robbery. There's a whole bunch of dollars in there. Just imagine how rich you and I are gonna be. Mikey, you're crazy. No, this is a deeply thought out and ingenious plan. You and I are going to be the richest people in the world. Bank employees are so stupid. They didn't notice that hole in the wall. Yeah, I'm shocked at you, Mikey. So we're gonna rob this bank on the sly? But how do you open the next door? Boy, next door won't be much of a problem for us. I've heard that phrase somewhere, but you need a pin code to get through. There's no other way in. You're wrong. There's one cool way to open that door. What's that way? A very cool and effective way, I'll tell you. It's dynamite. Oh my god, you're gonna blow up this whole bank with us? No, you're gonna do it. Why me? This is your plan. Stop arguing. You need to plant a bomb right on that door. Stop stalling, JJ, or the guards will be here soon. Oh my god, I'm actually scared. What if it explodes too fast? I have a five-second timer set there. We can get a safe distance. Okay, I'd get as far away from this house as possible. Um, I thought the explosion would be bigger. Wow, there's so much money. Way to go, JJ. That's enough money to last us a lifetime. How are we supposed to take all this stuff with us? These are huge stacks of money and gold bars. Oh my god, JJ, you're always so stupid. Just break the money blocks and put it in your pocket. Seriously? It doesn't work like that in real life. And we're not in real life. We're in Minecraft life. Okay, I'll try. Five minutes later. Here we are with all the money in this vault. I told you we should have just broken the money blocks. You're right, but there was so much money here that my pockets are already completely full. We need to get out of here. Otherwise, the sound of noise could attract the police. Well, yes, because we exploded a powerful bomb here. Although those stupid guards didn't even hear it. These are the most useless guards in the world. And you were afraid that we would be caught and put in prison. This money is literally pouring out of my hands. Well, it's not every day that I rob a bank with you. I hope we don't have to do this anymore. Oh my god, where did all the money in the bank go? There were huge piles of dollars right there. And now there are two to three bills lying around here. The robbers were unable to take everything with them. Detective work is hard, you know. I need more evidence to find out who could have done this. Good afternoon, detective. The robbers acted quietly and smoothly, but we found out how they got here. And how did they do it? Follow me. They were real diggers. It was not easy to dig such a tunnel. Here they went into the bank vault. Um, how did the bank security not notice this hole earlier? It is amazing. I think I should walk through this tunnel. Maybe I'll find some clues. Oh my god, what a deep tunnel this is. Surely I'm dealing with some kind of professional robbers. If I catch them, I will definitely receive a bonus to my salary. So the robbers made an entrance right outside the bank fence? Oh my god, the security guards don't do anything here at all. No fingerprints or footprints. I don't know how to find them. Oh, what is this? I think I found my first clue. A bunch of small bills are lying on the ground. It looks like the robbers didn't notice this when they took the money to their hideout. So these thieves are not smart at all. I think I can follow this money trail after them. Three hours later. They've already dropped thousands and thousands of dollars. With each bill, I become more and more convinced that this is their first robbery. All this money belongs to the bank. I'll put these guys in jail. Oh, and this is where this trail of bills ends. This is the home of those thieves. I thought it was some kind of abandoned old building. And this is some kind of house for small children. House in the shape of a rabbit. How ridiculous this is. We have so much money. With this money, we can buy ourselves a million burgers, a powerful computer, a game console, and much more. Oh yeah, your surprise was the coolest, Mikey. Okay, let's go to bed already. Fine. Oh, who else has come? I wasn't expecting any guests today. I'm somehow getting scared. After all, we just robbed a bank. Maybe it's just the delivery guy who got the wrong address. Maybe we shouldn't open the 
door. I really don't like this, Mikey. Stop being afraid of everything in the world. JJ, you are such a coward. I'm not a coward. What if there are a lot of police there and we have a lot of cash on hand? Better hide it in my pockets. We'll quickly see who's calling and close the door. All right, let's go. You're under arrest. Hands in the air. What's going on? You stole all the money in the bank. This is a felony. You're going to jail. But we didn't do anything. All we did was play on the computer at home all day. There's nothing to put us in jail for. You're lying. There's a trail of bank money leading to your house. What kind of money? You're lying and making things up. I'm sick of all this. Stop lying. I need to do a search. You don't have to do that. We don't have anything at home. And that's what we're about to test. Get out of here. I'm going to find this pile of money. You two stupid thieves. All right, then. Let her look for something we don't have. Shut up, both of you. You're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. We didn't do anything. This is some kind of mistake. Someone set us up. We don't care. Come with us to the police station. We'll sort it out there. Hey, don't touch me. You're hurting me. These handcuffs are too small for me. Because you're fat. Your hands are too big. Eat less burgers. You have no right to insult us. Ha 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 ha. We're entitled to whatever we want. If we find the stolen money, we'll take half of it for ourselves. Good idea, man. I'm a cop just for that. What are you guys talking about? We're in trouble. There's no money here at all. Not a single coin. These guys are totally poor. Uh, what are we supposed to do? Stop whining. Let's go to the police station. We have to question them. I hope they'll talk. What a strict boss we have. She pisses me off so much at times. Hey, actually, I can hear you. Idiots. Oh, excuse me, ma'am. It doesn't matter. Get me to the station now. This is a very serious crime. We have to find that money. Where a whole mountain of money could have disappeared. Now tell me, where is the money from the bank? And what did you do last night? If you don't answer, you'll go to jail. Um, actually, I don't know what happened to your money. It's not my money. This is the bank's money. Well, okay, so be it. You're avoiding the question. Where's the money? Where were you yesterday? Yesterday, I sat at home and played Minecraft. I then fought against a crowd of zombies with a golden sword. What kind of nonsense is this? What should I start with? Yesterday in Minecraft, I started raising pigs because I didn't have any food. And then Mikey killed all the pigs. What does this have to do with pigs? Actually, they were zombie pigs. They cannot be bred. It was against them that I broke my golden sword. It was a shame. Oh my god, tell us about the tunnel. We had one tunnel in Minecraft yesterday. And guess what? Those same unfinished pigs turned out to be there. Stop talking about the computer game. Yesterday, we played Minecraft all day. Let's get back to the pigs. I think these pigs came from a portal to hell. You're both kidding me. I'm talking to you absolutely seriously. Mikey killed all the pigs. I'm so tired of you and your pigs in Minecraft. What did we say wrong? We told you the truth, detective. You will sit behind bars and then decide where you spent so much money. What kind of money? We are poor guys. Poor? You stole a whole vault of money. These bills couldn't just disappear. I will definitely find where you hid them. Hey, don't go. Let us out of here. Oh my God, looks like we'll never get out of here. And why did I even listen to you? We need some kind of plan to get out of here. How will you do it? The door is closed. There's no way we'll open it. No one will help us at all. You're too excited. It's night now, which means it's time for us to sleep. I don't want to sleep here. It's uncomfortable to sleep behind bars. As you wish, I'll sleep. Are you so indifferent to everything around you? Oh my god, maybe I should sleep too. Um, what happened here? Why are they lying on the floor? Did they really die this night while they were here? Oh my god! Apparently they were too worried when they were sent to prison. It was not clear from them that they were some kind of dangerous robbers. Um, then I need to get rid of the bodies. What happened here? These two guys are dead. I don't even know why. You shouted at them so much yesterday. Apparently they died out of fear of you. Does this happen? Yes. Sometimes it happens if the heart is weak. We need to bury them in the cemetery. They definitely don't belong here. Oh my god, I shouldn't have yelled at them so much. How I feel sorry for them. Arrange for their funeral now. Why should I do this? Oh my god, I hate this job. I got a job as a policeman, not as a graveyard undertaker. Oh, I woke up. 
Where am I? We were in prison. Are we underground? Mikey is here too. Where did they put us? I don't think this is a new prison. Mikey, get up. We have problems again, and all because of you. Get your turtle butt up. Um, where are we? We're underground, Mikey. What should we do? It was more comfortable in prison than here. Apparently, the police thought we were dead and buried us. But we were still warm. How could they do this? Apparently, they are very stupid. But we have a lot of money. Oh, that's right. They forgot to look in our pockets. Ha ha ha. We are still rich. But what should we do with these riches if we are underground? I don't know. All these pieces of paper are useless. The next morning. Let's go home and play computer games. I'd play the new GTA 6 if you don't mind. JJ, did you forget? We have a very old and weak computer. We need to buy a new one. And where do you propose to find the money for a new computer? I don't know. Ask mom and dad like we always did. We can try. I just need to find out the prices of new computers. Oh, I think we almost passed the right store. The store? There aren't any stores around here. JJ, are you blind? There's a computer store right in front of you. Oh, that's just what we need. Look at those beautiful monitors. And what a nice backlit computer. Oh my god, I want it. Yeah, I wouldn't say no to this handsome guy, but it's too expensive for our parents. How much does it cost? A whole stack of diamonds. That's a lot of money, Mikey. Oh, and we need monitors too. What are we gonna do? What's there to guess? My mom will definitely give me a lot of money. Why would she give you money? Because I'm the favorite child in the family. Did you forget that? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Let's go. Recently, my mom gave me like a hundred diamonds for my shopping. Oh my God, Mikey. You could have bought us that computer a long time ago. I lost all that money at the casino. My mom will give me more money. Don't worry. Our parents are right at home. Why did you give all the money to Mikey? We're not that rich. They're just talking about you. Because they love me. Hey, they love me too. Hey mom, can I have some money? Money, please? Yes, of course. Stop right there. Stop giving him all the money. How do you even spend it? We want to buy a new super duper mega powerful gaming computer. That must be a very expensive purchase, Mikey. Nobody's gonna give you any money. You two little spenders. But mom, dad, I love you guys. Do you love me? No, 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 no. That trick won't work again. Ha 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 ha, Mikey. Your plan didn't work. Now we won't give them any money. Uh, what do you mean no money? No money at all? Yeah, not one dollar. You already have a computer. You don't need another one. Oh my god, this is really bad news. How are we supposed to live without a new computer? You didn't talk them down, Mikey. They've got a lot of nerve. I'm the only one in the family who works. We don't have much money. Yeah, our parents have become poor on your wants, Mikey. I thought they were super rich. We should have taken advantage of that while we could. Yeah, we're not going to get a new computer now. We need to come up with some new plan. That computer has to be ours. Uh, what if we steal this computer? It's just like in all those movies about thieves. Isn't that dangerous? It looks very simple in the cartoon. Uh, it's kind of of scary. Don't be afraid. Although we can get a new computer for free. Without paying a cent. Good plan, JJ. I'm in. We're gonna be real robbers, Mikey. We need a really cool and clever plan to steal that computer. We'll do it tonight, Mikey. We'll do it quietly and quickly. No one will notice us. Solid plan, JJ. Solid as a Swiss watch. Yeah. <laughs> And here comes the night. Time to go out and rob the store. It's been dark outside for a long time. It's time to go outside. Why do the robberies happen at night? Because no one can see you at night, Mikey. That's a stupid question coming from you. Uh-oh, I think our parents are still awake. Why are they still watching TV? SpongeBob is an unreal cool guy. They're watching cartoons, just like little kids. We can sneak outside. Just don't make any noise and don't shout loudly. Okay, okay, just don't scream yourself. SpongeBob looks so much like like me, just as fun and interesting. Yes, darling, you are my grown up and big SpongeBob. Hee hee hee. They don't even care about us. I'd be watching cartoons right now, too. The computer's cooler, JJ. Watch cartoons for toddlers or for old people like our parents. Mikey, you watched 10 hours of cartoons last night without stopping. I was a toddler then. Now I'm a grown up thief on a mission. What a ridiculous excuse, Mikey. It doesn't matter. Let's go rob a store already, JJ. Let's go, Mikey. I already want to play cool new games on that computer. Hey, we're both going to play on this computer. There's that store. Gotta make it quick and run home with the computer. Here's our handsome boy. I agree. It's unrealistically beautiful and cool. All right. You watch the corner so no one sees us. I'll go to the store. All right. Not a mouse is gonna get past me. I'll see anyone who can get in our way. No one's here, Mikey. We're good to go. And there's a locked door. What do I do? Oh, really? We didn't think of that. We need to come up with a new plan. I have an idea. You run up and break that glass with your head. You're still brainless. I'm gonna punch you for saying that. It's not bad for you. Come on, you can do it. Okay, I'm gonna get a boost. Come on! Hey, how? <laughs> You're so hard-headed. Let's get the monitors and computers. Then I'll play first 
first for a whole week because I've done the hardest work here. Okay, okay, okay. Hurry up already. Someone might see the two of us in here. It's not that easy, you know. Faster. Stop whining. It feels so good to touch it with your hands. You would know that. Did you do that on purpose? Hurry up. I don't like it anymore. Yeah, you're so funny when you're angry, JJ. I got everything we need. We can go home now. We have to make it before our parents notice us. Oh my God, what is that sound? Looks like the alarm went off. The police are coming here right now. We have to run away now. We need to hide around the corner. You don't want to stand right in front of a broken storefront. I think I can hear a police car already. I'm so scared. Here come the cops. We're in big trouble. We need to sit tight so we don't get spotted, Mikey. Okay, who did this? What kind of stupid burglar broke this window? The door to the store was open. Was the door open? We're so stupid. And why is she dressed like a dancer at a strip club? Looks like they stole the computers. The robbers were little kids. That's right. We gotta go, Mikey. She's starting to figure it out. She's so beautiful. Let me look at her for another minute. Are you serious? We have to go. I wonder what they broke the window with. Some kind of small TV? Wake up. We're going to jail if you don't stop staring at her. She has such nice hips. What hips? Are you crazy? Let's go home, you horny idiot. Oh, she's right there. I gotta get out of here. You're finally awake. I'm not going on any more missions with you. Oh, come on. That went super cool. We got the computer. Now we're gonna play all night. Because we're lucky. Your stupidity might have gotten us noticed. It's water-cooled RTX 4060 graphics card with 16 gigabytes of video memory. It's all included. I didn't understand a single word at all. Looks like our parents have gone to bed. That's a good thing. No one will notice us, and we won't be interrupted from playing all night. We're very lucky tonight. It could have gone better if you hadn't been staring at that cop. You saw how beautiful she was. I haven't seen such attractive girls in a long time. What girls? You're six years old, Mikey. I'm an adult in my head. It doesn't matter. Time to play new and cool games on our computer. It's so big. You know what else I got big? These monitors. Oh, I was already thinking about the other big thing, Mikey. What you were thinking? Say it to my face. About your big brainless head, Mikey. I won't even take offense to you. Look how nice his work is. Yes, it's so colorful and flashing. You can tell it's worth a lot of diamonds. And then there are these monitors. What a clear and pleasing picture. I feel so good sitting at this computer. Go ahead and run all the top games already. Stop licking this computer. I think even the taste of this computer would be very tasty. But we won't be eating it, of course. We can play a game of Minecraft. Okay, why don't we play this game for the thousandth time? What else are we supposed to play? I don't know. Oh my god, this computer is amazing. I could spend my whole life sitting here. How long have we been sitting here? It's morning, Mikey. We've been sitting here all night. That's great. Just the way I wanted to spend the night. You know, I'm a little tired tired already. It's going to be 7 in the morning and we haven't even slept. I don't care at all. Let's keep playing. No, I want to sleep. Oh, who's calling so early in the morning? I don't know. Maybe it's the mailman. The mailman just put the letters in the box and walk away. Let's go see who's been banging on our door. I'm getting scared. Maybe they've come for us? I don't know. Maybe it's just our distant relatives coming to visit. We don't have any such relatives. This is something very bad. Let's just open the door. Hello, can I see your parents? I need to talk to them urgently. Oh my god. It's a female police officer. I'm a police officer from the local police department. Get your parents now, kid. They're in our house. Come on in. I wonder why she came to see us. Why are you here? Somebody robbed a computer store near here. I'm canvassing all the neighbors near it. Oh, we didn't do that, by the way. Go call our parents already. Don't worry. They're coming to you now. Hey, Mom, Dad, we got a visitor at the house. He wants to see you. And who's there? It's a police woman. The police? In our house? Oh, my God. Oh, my God, police. What happened? Hello. Good morning. What's wrong? Recently, there was an absolute robbery at a computer store near you. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Oh, well, let's go in the kitchen then. We'll all talk in there together. Whatever you say, ma'am. Let's go in the kitchen. Oh, while you guys are talking, we're going for a walk with Mikey. They're on to something, JJ. Your sons are robbers. We saw them on the cameras. They smashed the window and stole a computer. Oh my God, this is awful. Mikey, we gotta get out of here. Looks like we've been burned. Time to go on the run. I don't want to go to jail. I don't want to go there either. Let's get out of here. We can't let them hear us. We shouldn't have committed this crime, JJ. I'm already terribly ashamed of it. Stop right there. The camera showed the green TV man smashing the display case and stealing everything in it. But there was a J 
JJ there too. Were they both there? Mikey, shut up. Don't mess with me. All the crimes were committed by one man. Mikey's the only one to blame. Oh, really? Now that's fair. It's not fair. I don't want to go to jail. He's just a baby. Please don't do this. Yes, let our parents punish us. No, I found the criminal and it's Mikey. I'm getting handcuffed. Please forgive me. Guys, don't apologize. Let's go to jail, you little criminal. Mikey, I'm going to write you letters to prison. You're going to be a real criminal mastermind. Get in the car now, you criminal. Oh my God, my son is a felon. I'm so embarrassed. I don't want to go to jail. I'll be so bad there. This is a disgrace to our family. Stop babysitting him. You can see him in prison. Bye, everybody. Oh my God, I didn't expect that at all. Yeah, well, Mikey sure did a bad thing. Yes, he's so small. He's in first grade, and now he won't go to school. Cool. Also, you were there too. You're a criminal too. Hey, but I wasn't arrested. It's not my fault. The cameras showed you were there too. I didn't expect this from you. Now you'll be grounded for a whole month. Seriously? But I didn't break anything and I didn't steal it. So you made Mikey do it. He's so good. This is your fault. We'll punish you. Yes, he won't go out for a month. Walking is forbidden. This is a very serious punishment. Wow, cool. Oh, I mean, how sad. If you leave your room, we'll punish you even more. Don't you dare come out of there. You're awful. Isn't that a bit much? Just right, sweetheart. Oh, I'm so sick of not walking. Ha ha! I still have that computer. I'm gonna play on it for a month. Now that's the real punishment I've been waiting for. I'm so lucky. As long as Mikey's in jail, I'll be playing all the games. Now this super mega powerful computer belongs only to me. How cool is that? I'm so excited. The next day. Today, my friend Mikey and I went out for a walk and to show you our new home. Hey, hey! JJ and I built a little secret house not far from here. We need to make sure we're not followed and then we can go. There's no one here, Mikey. We can go to our house. Let's go, JJ. We have to get there undetected. Don't worry, Mikey. I made sure there are no people around and no one can see us. Good job, JJ. Here we are at our cabin. We can go in and start the full preparations. JJ, are you sure there's no one around? Yeah, Mikey, I'm sure. There's not a human soul around. Then we can begin our final preparations for the bank robbery. Cool. Come on, JJ, we gotta hurry up. Let's go. Stop. What's wrong? How many times do I have to tell you to close the door? Right. Sorry, Mikey. Okay, let's go. I hope no one heard the hatch opening. That was really loud. Here we are at our underground base with a robbery plan. We've got a rifle and a shotgun and a plan to rob a bank. That's right. The marks indicate where all the jewels are in the bank. If all goes well, we will be incredibly rich. That's right. If we take it all away, we'll never work again. But the problem is, we're one man short for the robbery. Yeah, we are sorely lacking one more person. That's why we can't go rob a bank right now. It's all very sad. I can't wait to be rich. But I don't have any friends that I can bring with me. Don't worry, Mikey. Let's go find us a mate. That's a great idea, JJ. There's no need to get upset before the time. It can still be done. I think so, too. You have to be patient for a while so you don't have to deny yourself anything. Come on, JJ. We gotta hurry up. Okay. Before we look for our partner, let's go get a little snack. Totally agree. Where are we going? I know where we're going. There's a great cafe over that way. It sells a really good seafood soup. Let's go. We'll discuss our plan there. This little one is up to something. Something very bad. We have to go to the police station and report to the chief about what we've heard. We'd better hurry up, or they'll never know what they're up to. This app is going to drive me crazy. It lags all the time. Chief! Chief! I have some very important information for you. Two teenagers are up to something terrible. They're discussing some kind of plan. Do you hear me? Ah? Uh, what? Of course I can hear you. Well, then you have a very important assignment. You need to get on their team, gain their trust, and tell me what they want to do. But Chief, what if they're up to something dangerous? I wonder how I can gain their trust. Think about it. Okay, I'm ready for this mission. I'll change into a normal girl's clothes and go meet them. I doubt they'll be able to refuse to meet me. Goodbye, Chief. Goodbye. Why did she come if she knows everything? I don't understand. You've just wasted your time. The next day. All right, Mikey, let's go tweak our plan. Maybe there's a way we can make this a two-man robbery. Let's go, JJ. Maybe there really is another way to get all the jewelry. Guys. Who's that, Mikey? A cute girl behind you. What? Hey, guys, wait for me. I can't catch up with you. She's so cute. Hello. Hello. I saw you from a distance. I'd like to meet you. Wow, Mikey, I think we can do it. It's very unexpected. Such a beautiful girl wants to meet us. Very beautiful. Oh, thank you, guys. But, Mikey, we need to discuss the work plan. Yeah, JJ, we need to go now. It's okay, guys. We can meet at the restaurant tonight and get to know each other better. Wow, that's cool. great. Cool. We'll be there for sure. Yeah. See you at the restaurant. All right. I'll wait for you there. Bye. See you soon.
Did you see that, Mikey? Yes. Such a beautiful girl. It's true. She must have liked me. That's why she approached us. What? She likes me, not you. What did you say? She wasn't even paying attention to you. On the contrary. All she did was look at me. You'll see. I'll date her. No, she'll be with me. Don't even think about it. I'll go to the restaurant with her alone. Wait. We were looking for a third partner for the robbery. What if we call her? Wait. I didn't even think of that. We're really missing one person. That's a great idea, JJ. Yeah. Then let's not tell her about the robbery. Let's just go repeat our plan to the end. Cool. Pretty soon we'll be the richest. I can't wait, Mikey. Wait, let's make sure no one's following us. Who cares? I'm coming down. Look, JJ. Now our well-prepared escape plan can easily be turned into reality. Yeah. The two of us will take out everything precious from these points. Cool. And the girl will stand at that moment and make sure that no one calls the police. All set, Mikey. Just gotta meet the girl. Wahaha. <laughs> Three hours later. Let's hurry up, JJ. We're late. Don't worry, Mikey. We're here. There he is. Elite restaurant. A great place to implement the last part of the plan. Let's go. We're already waiting. JJ, don't say anything about the robbery. I remember, Mikey. It's okay. Wow, this place is beautiful. So many interesting things. Yeah, I really like being here. I wonder where she's sitting. Hello. Welcome to our restaurant. Do you have a reservation? Yeah, we have a table for three with a girl. Okay, where is she sitting? We don't know. I think she's on the second floor. Yeah, I saw a girl sitting there. Come on, I'll take you to her. Cool. I'm incredibly hungry. I hope the food here is good. Yay. Let's go. What are you standing there for? Let's move. Finally, we get to eat and meet this beauty. And of course, we'll get her ready for work. Okay. Your girlfriend's sitting right here. Okay, okay. She's already ordered food and is waiting for you. Come on, JJ. Go, go, go. Lady, your friends are here. Finally. Hello. Hi. Hey, guys. Come on in. Sit down. I already ordered some food. All right, let's sit down. Can I get you anything else to eat or drink? We'll call you if we need you. Okay, enjoy your meal and thank you for choosing our restaurant. Thank you. Thanks. No problem. So, what's your guys' names? My name is Mikey, and this is my friend JJ. Yeah. Cool. Nice to meet you. My name is TV Woman. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. I overheard your dialogue. Could you tell me about your work? Hee hee hee. What? Why are you laughing? Is it something bad or embarrassing? No, absolutely not. It's a small job for 20 minutes, but we'll pay you very well. Will you pay me well? Then I think I'll help you with your work. Cool. That is great. We were just one man short. Now everything will go according to plan. Tell me a little bit about what you do. It's not a big deal. Let's just eat our food before it gets cold. Don't worry. You're going to love it. Yeah. All right. The next morning. How much longer do we have to go? Be patient, JJ. We're almost there. There he is. I can see your house. Here we go. We're finally here. I can't wait for the robbery already. All we have to do is call TV Woman and we can go to work. We can go get her. Just a question, did you remember to bring your gun so she can't see him? Of course, JJ, there he is. I would definitely remember to take him. I haven't forgotten mine either. Let's go get her. We have to go. All right, let's go knock. Just don't blab about the robbery. Don't worry, JJ, I won't. Why can't she hear me? Because you should be ringing the doorbell, not knocking. That's right. Come on out already. I can't wait to be incredibly rich. Me too, JJ. We're going to be rich today. Who's banging on the door like that? Oh, it's you. Hey, Mikey. Hi. Hey, JJ. Hello. We're here to pick you up for work. We're going in this car right here. Are you ready to go? Yeah. I'm ready to go help you with the job. Cool. Come on. We have to hurry. You won't tell me about the job? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Okay. Then let's go quickly. I can't wait to find out. Go, go, go. Should I ride in the back? Yay. Get in the back. Mikey and I are in the front. Okay, no problem. Okay, let's go. Get in the driver's seat already, Mikey. We gotta get going. All right, JJ, I'm coming. Now we're off to become incredibly rich people. Let's rob that bank already. Go, go, go. Are you sure I can do your job? Because you won't even tell me about it. Don't worry, there's nothing complicated about it. You can definitely do it. You just have to be a little bit more assertive and pushy. But why? What kind of job is that? Hurry up, hurry up. Well, here we are. Yeah. What's the plan? Hmm, why don't we just blow the place up? Huh, what? Mikey, what are you talking about? A uh, TV woman? He's just kidding. It's okay. Oh, yeah, this is the moment worth living for. Oh, hmm. All right, everybody ready? Oh, yeah, I'm ready to do that. Oh, this is so exciting. You'll have the honor of handling the most difficult part of the plan. Yeah, you'll just have to keep track of the people inside. It's important. Uh, why? Well, you don't need to know that. Let's go inside. Okay, let's go. Mikey, did you get the gun? Uh, guns? It's just a toy. Hee hee hee. Yeah, no one gets hurt by my gun unless I want them to. Yeah. Wait, hmm. is that a real weapon? Yes, and you should follow our orders if life is precious. Put your hands in the air. It's a robbery. Well, if life is precious to you, listen to us. Let's go. Everybody go to that corner of the building. And let's not get knocked.
naughty. Yeah. Our friend will look after you all. Yes, our benevolent and obedient TV woman will look after all these people, right? Oh, my God. Otherwise, I'll have to deal with them all right now. No, no, it's okay. I'll do it. That's great. Stand still and don't move. In the meantime, we'll go and get everything in this bank. You can count on me. Hmm. Really? I'll look after all the people here. Hmm. Okay, okay. Let's go, JJ. Uh, Mikey, that's all very nice. But why did she agree to help us so easily? I mean, that's really weird. I don't know. Maybe she's just stupid. Yes, maybe. Oh, JJ, it doesn't matter now. We're robbing a bank. Oh, my God. Yes, Mikey, we need to focus on that huge safe. I'm just shocked, JJ. Mikey, how do we open the safe? Oh, JJ, a safe like that is very hard to open. Uh, that's why I have a great suggestion. What are we going to do? We'll just blow the place up. Oh, my God. Mikey, that's genius. Let's do it. It's a good thing I've already got it all set up. Cool. Here you go, JJ. Oh, uh, why exactly do I have to do this? You're in charge, so you do it. All right, all right, Mikey. I'll remember that for you. Well... Okay, I started the timer. Uh, Mikey, where'd you go? Did he just leave me? Oh, my God. Ah! Uh, it's not that scary. What's up, JJ? I'm fine. Wow, uh, look at all this treasure. Oh, holy mama's sneakers. There's enough gold and diamonds here for hundreds of our lives. We have to take everything that's here, JJ, but how? Hmm. I certainly can't carry it all in my hands. Uh, what are we supposed to do then? Hmm, well, there's not much choice here, for example. Oh. I could bring a couple of picks and we could finish it all off right now. Mikey, you're amazing. Let's get it all. Yeah, and let's get out of here after that. Time is money. Okay, let's go. So they've been gone for a while now and people here have calmed down a bit. So it's time to do my job as a cop. These guys don't know who they're messing with. I'm gonna clean up what they've done here. I'll call my colleagues to come here right now. These two aren't expecting a setup at all. Did it go well? Yes, I've got it all figured out. Come to the bank quickly. We'll be at your place soon. These guys are armed. Bring SWAT. People's lives are at stake. Hurry up. Five minutes later. JJ, we were able to take absolutely everything out of here. Huh, Mikey? Your hands are all filled with diamonds. JJ, your hands look just as good. Lots of gold and money. Yeah, Mikey. And I think it's time to get out of here. We're taking too long. JJ, what's your hurry? There's our TV woman. Mikey, you've completely forgotten that we're using her. Come on, JJ. She's pretty. She could betray us at any moment. Calm down, JJ, and let's just, uh... Mikey? You broke the safe? Yeah, they're in there. Uh... Here come our criminals. Did you really think you could do your illegal things as long as you wanted? Oh, my God! There's a limit to everything. You both will be severely punished. Uh, what about a You'll lawyer? You'll both spend 20 years behind bars. I promise you that. No lawyer can help you get away with all the crimes you both committed. Accept your fate. Uh, what are we gonna do, Mikey? I don't think we have any more options, JJ. It's over. Oh, my God. Hmm. A few moments later... I'm an officer, JJ. What am I doing here? I'm doing my job, huh? And a list of recent felonies. Hey, can I come in? Who is it? Hey, JJ, it's me. Whoa, Officer Mikey, hey. Hey. You know, I don't even know which case to take first. I think the first place we should start is with a snack. Wow, huh? I don't mind. I brought your favorite donuts. Oh, Divine Police Donuts. Look. Mikey, you're the best. It's all for our good police work. Bon appetit. Delicious donuts. Oh, these are delicious. JJ, I've been thinking about how we haven't had a serious accident in a long time. Huh, that's for sure. We only found these guys. So what are we going to do together today? I don't know. We can try. Call it in, officers. We're listening, Chief. We have an emergency. I need everyone in my office right now. We're finally being called in, JJ. Oh. It must be urgent if the Chief's calling us. Uh, what about the donuts? They're not going anywhere. Oh, okay, but I'll eat them when we're done. Since you like them so much, I'll buy you 100 donuts after this case. 100 donuts? I've never dreamed of anything like this. Hey. It's JJ and Mikey. Can we come in? Come on in. Let's go. Oh, hello, Chief. Hello, sir. Without further ado, I'll get to the point. There was a serious offender in the woods a while back. Wow, big assignment. Don't interrupt me. Oh. You have to catch the pig. Uh, did he say pig? Yeah, I heard that too. Uh, are you sure, Chief? Yes, you silly boy. Uh... Get on with the job before I fire you. Oh, all right, all right. I guess the Chief's not in the mood today. Don't try my patience, you insolent. Oh, good, good, good. We're on our way to solve this case. Everything's gonna be fine. Oh my god, what is wrong with the Chief? We're going after the pig, really. We're gonna have to do this, Mikey. <laughs> hmm... I don't think anyone else is going to bother me. Oh, finally those fools are gone. Now I can do my dark deeds while everyone else is busy doing useless things. Huh, such stupid people. How can you fall for the old disguise maneuver so easily? <coughs> oh, what a beautiful night. I hope no one attacks a fine lady like me. Huh, it's like I'm in a horror movie. I'm just walking home in peace. Is there someone here? No one will remember you. Wait!
target located? Maintaining surveillance on the target. All right, Mikey. Looks like we found the right pig. I'll do it. Are you ready to catch it? Of course. All right, let's go, Officer Mikey. I'll also do it lightning fast. Hmm. Maybe when we catch this one, we can barbecue it. Huh, that's a good idea. I'm a little hungry. All right, all right. Wait, JJ. Let's go. No, JJ, why? Uh... Uh, I must have scared it. Well, of course you scared it. Oh, no, let's go get it. You lost him, JJ. Stop right there, Piggy. Hooves up. Get that pig, Mikey. I'm not doing this alone. Help me. Piggy, you can't escape our hunger. Piggy. Wait, Piggy, we just want to get the job done. Wait. You're a criminal. <gasps> oh, my God. Mikey, hurry up. It Mom's here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, leave me alone. Huh, that's a different story. Huh, didn't see that coming, pig. Don't run away like a cowardly pig. Yay, let's go, Mikey. Wahaha. <laughs> Two hours later. Huh, that piggy's got a lot of strength. Wait, piggy. Fuh, no, Mikey, we can't keep up with it. Whoa, JJ, you're giving up already. Yeah, I'm tired. Oh, look at this. I shouldn't have eaten those donuts. <gasps> oh, that pig is making fun of us. What do you think you're doing? We've been humiliated, pig, Mikey. Oh, you know what I think. Hmm, I'm listening to you. I think this assignment is terrible. Hmm. I'm not going to chase a pig anymore. Oh, I agree with you. This assignment blows. Oh, what's that over there? Oh, hmm. I don't see anything wrong with it. There's a foot sticking out. All right, let's go. Hurry up. Hmm. I'm getting a funny feeling about this. Ew, no. That's the smell of a junkyard. See? Oh, no. It's someone's feet sticking out. That's horrible. Get the body, Mikey. Okay. Just be careful you don't break anything on this poor guy. Huh? Is this body so light or am I so strong? Oh, it's Speaker Woman. We're sorry to hear about your bad luck, girl. We'll find and punish the culprit. We promise. Do you think there's any evidence left in the trash can? Yeah, maybe there's something in there. Hmm. Who's going to go in there? Oh, no, no, no. Not me. But Mikey... What? I don't want to go in there either. Well... All right, let's play stone, scissors, paper to be fair. Oh, great idea. I'm in. I will crush you with my stone. Huh, okay. I'm gonna win. So, stone, stone scissors, scissors, scissors paper. paper. I've got paper. I've got scissors. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Scissors cutting paper. I win. Oh, Get in the trash can, Mikey. All right, all right. I got it. Oh, it's all for you, sweet lady. Uh, okay. Don't try to distract me, Mikey. I'm not even trying to do that. All right, let's go. Oh, I really don't want to do this. Ew. If I don't come back, tell my family I love them. Huh, come on, Mikey. So there's nothing here and there's nothing here. Oh, I don't envy him right now. Ew, there's a dead mouse in here. Oh, Gross. did you find anything in there? Oh, yeah, I think I found something. Mikey, get out and show me what you found. Well, here I am. JJ, look at what I'm holding. No way. Only police officers in the department wear caps like that. You're absolutely right, JJ. Which means the perpetrator is on Attention, the police Attention, everybody. Force. Mikey, the chief's on the phone. What? Hello? Oh, hello, sir. Are you even listening to me? We're on the line. We're listening. Your assignment has been canceled. What? Return to my office immediately. He's so rude. JJ, never mind. It's just a grudge against the world. Uh, don't tell him you went through the trash. Yeah, I don't think we should do that. You... Uh, what are we going to do with the body? Let's go to the office and show the evidence and pick up the body later. Uh, Nobody's going to take it now. All right, let's hurry up. Mikey, you don't think this is a coincidence? Yeah, I don't think so. So let's go find out. If he's not wearing his cap, it means he was involved in her death. Who's banging on the door? Captain, it's Mikey and JJ. Just a second. Yes, come in. And here you are. So... How's the murder case coming along? In progress, sir. There's a suspicion of one man. Great. Here's some more paperwork to get this ready for tomorrow morning. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Where's your cap? That's against regulations. It's none of your business. I see you have a lot of free time on your hands. No, sir. JJ, we got work to do. Let's go. Then get out of my office. JJ, did you see him get mad at us about the cap? Yeah, now he's angry. We need to check out what he's doing here. But how? We'll follow him through the cameras in our precinct. Then we'll be 100% convinced of him. That's a great idea. Then get on the computer and log on. And I'll make sure no one comes in. Okay, Mikey. If you find something, let me know. So let's see what we've got here. Hmm. Yep, I found it. I didn't know we had cameras in the bathroom. Okay, that's the garage. It's a skibbity toilet. I wonder what he's planning. That's what we're about to find out. JJ, rewind. I wonder what he was doing at our boss's place. <gasps> skibbity toilet is our boss. Oh my god. JJ, make a copy of this video. I'm sure we'll need it again. Mikey, are you seeing this too? Yeah, I can't believe it either. That's it. The copy's ready. What do we do next? 
Now we have to apprehend him. We have the evidence. Mikey, he's our boss. How are we going to do this? Let me think about it, JJ. Hmm, I got it. We'll go to the military. They'll take care of him for sure. I'm hoping for it. It'll be fine. Come on, I know how to go to them. Here we are, practically there. Yeah, I can see that, Mikey. I'm not feeling too good here. It's kind of gloomy. Authorized personnel only. Are we sure they'll let us in here? I'm worried. Don't worry so much. Everything will be fine. I'm sure of it. And there's the gate. Here we are. Now we have to get inside. But I don't see anyone. Yeah, I don't see anyone either. Hey, JJ, look how big the base is. Whoa, it's just a huge base. But is there really no one at the entrance? I don't think so. Hey, who's there? This is a secure area. No one is allowed in here. What are you doing here? We've come to see the colonel on very important matters. Yes, it's true. All right, I'll report you. Base to gate. Two cops are here. What do we do with them? What do they want? They said they had a very important conversation with the colonel. All right, let them come through. Bring them to us. Yes, sir. Come on, I'll show you to the colonel. Get in that car over there. Wow, we're going in a military Humvee? Yes. It's very cool. Sit down. Mikey, I've never driven one of these cars. It's going to be awesome. Me too. JJ, it's going to be exciting. So much room inside. I wanted a car like this to take on road trips. But only you get to travel on your own too. Wow, this must be their shooting range. It's so beautiful and dangerous at the same time. Maybe I should join the army too. Mikey, what do you think? I don't think you'd last a day in the army. Are you sure about that? Maybe I should argue with you some more. I'm just messing with you. You don't have to swear. Here we are, fellow policemen. That's great. Thank you. Thanks for the ride. I was just following orders. Here we are. Hope you didn't lose the disc, JJ. Of course not. It's with me all the time. Come on, let's go. They're waiting for us. Hmm, where do we go from here? JJ, there's only one door. I hope. It goes well. It's this way. Let's go. I hope so, too. Come in. Stop knocking. All right. Good luck to us. Let's go. <laughs> Greetings, Comrade Colonel. You're the one who wanted to see me? And what important conversation do you have for me? Here, take a look and you'll see for yourself, without further ado. Hmm. What? That can't be. He's skibbity toilet. And we knew each other well. Okay, we need to do something about him. Quickly, so he doesn't do any more damage. We need to raise an army and go to him before he hides somewhere. Quickly, follow me. I wonder what will happen to him now? I don't know, but it's going to be interesting. Skibidi Toilet, this building is surrounded will be destroyed by my tanks. Fire! What's going on here? I should have taken you out sooner. I'm so scared. That's a tale you can tell your cellmate. So we solved this crime. If it wasn't for the cameras, we wouldn't have known who was hiding from us. Two thousand years later. Mikey and I got jobs at the police station. That's cool, huh? Yay, JJ. Let's get something to eat. Oh, yeah, those daily snack donuts are the best. Mikey, what are the tasks we have to perform as police officers? You and I are supposed to be fair, honest, and we're supposed to catch thieves like them. Oh, yeah, we caught these two thieves just the other day. Yeah, it was a memorable Tuesday. Just think of what they did. Yeah. Well... Huh, what? Oh, hello, Chief. Hello, Honorable Chief. Hey, guys, I've got some awesome news for you. Hmm. You're going to be honored for your service. That's why there's an awesome new cop car waiting for you in the garage. <gasps> Congratulations. Here's your ignition key. Wow, that's quite a career move. JJ, I can't believe it. Mikey, this is the key to our cool new cop car. Let's go and see this cool car. Yeah, we should hurry up. Yay, let's hurry over there. Yeah, come on, let's go. It's so cool to be rewarded for our labors. Yeah. All available police oh, no. officers, please report to 9th Street. A woman's case has been found. Mikey, did you hear that? Yes, this is an urgent mission. We need to get out there right away. We gotta get out there and go hunting. Just in time to try out the new car the warden upgraded us with. Let's check this thing out. What do you think our new car looks like? I think it's a race car. What a great office we have here. 
come here. Yeah, Mikey, I'm coming. Well, this is the moment of truth. Let's go. Wow, look at this thing. Look at this. Yeah, cool. It's even got our names on the license plate. Hmm, interesting, interesting. Really? Yeah. I was wrong about the swallow. It's a giant honey badger. Mega cool. Honeybees are actually quite fast. Huh, what? If they have a reason to run fast, they can reach 19 miles an hour. Although, if you think about it, that's Mikey, not let's as go. impressive as I thought Work it awaits. was. I'll sit next to you. Oh, okay, I'll drive. This car is so good at the front. Wow, this is a lot more buttons than the last car. Ooh, lots of buttons. I love that this car is so big. Wow, that's a lot of speed. Wow, holy mama's casserole. You've got speed in the blink of an eye. This car is a beast. You're right. This is the best car we've ever had. We're going super fast. Holy turtles. JJ. Okay, watch out. We're not driving alone. Yes. So, Mikey, where are we going? Right. Listen carefully. Hmm. Turn right, then left. Go straight, then right, then straight again. Oh, my God. What? No, Mikey, talk normally. Well, did you know that adult turtles can carry four or five people? Oh, Mikey, watch the route. Which in turn is about 705 pounds, 48 pence. How far are we going? We're through the last corner. Oh, so close. Great. Finally, I'm getting tired. Good job, Mikey. You're practically the perfect navigator. Cool. Do you know the details of this case? Yes, I've learned that there's been an absolutely bloody attack here. Hmm, let the car stay here. Come on, let's go and see what happened. Wow, they've got yellow tape all over this place. JJ, look at this. Oh my god, Mikey. What could have happened here? I think it's some kind of fang or something. Yeah, a very gruesome looking TV woman's body. Sad. It looks terrible. Yeah, Mikey, something terrible has happened here. Yeah, I don't envy that TV woman. Yeah, first piece of evidence. Hmm, what's that? I think it's some kind of fang or something. Hmm, okay. Hmm. So what have we got here? Oh, what is it? I don't understand. What does it look like? I think it's a piece of cotton wool. Oh, uh, look, it's like animal hair, really? No, it's definitely candy floss. Huh, no. Let's go to the local zoo and ask the staff. Wow, good idea. The clues are coming together. Or maybe they'd at least know who did it. We've got to check that place out. Let's go. The case is almost solved. That was easy. We're the best cops in the world. If you hurry, you make people laugh, JJ. <clears throat> Oh, that's just an expression. Mikey, this is no joke. Get in the car. Oh, come on. Don't be mad. It's okay. I keep getting this weird feeling like we're missing something. I think you've been overworking a lot. Okay, okay. It's probably just nerves. Try listening to the music of the Skibbity Toilet sometime. Mikey! They're putting out some cool tracks now. Let's go to the zoo. Two hours later. We're here. And where's the manager? Where do we go? Let's go this way. Let's go. Yeah, this place is a maze. Yeah. Our office is better. Hmm. Here's the right door. Why don't you knock? All right, I'll do it. Hey, hey, hey. Hello, it's the police. Hey. Open up. We have a few questions. Open up, please. We're not bad. Oh, hello. Come in. Thank you for letting us in quietly. Um, what brings you to our lovely zoo? We're the police. My name is JJ. I'm the lead cop. Okay. And this is my assistant, Mikey. Yeah, I'm Mikey. And this is evidence. Did you know this TV woman? Oh, I don't know her. Would anyone at your zoo know? No. Hmm. Okay. Well... Do you know an animal that would have claws like that? No, we don't have animals like that. What about the last piece of evidence? What are you talking about? Hmm. No, 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 no. I don't know any animals that have claws like that. I'm sorry. Really? Hmm, Deputy Mikey, what do we do? I really don't know anything about it. He really doesn't know anything about this case. Come on. Hmm, okay. Sorry for the inconvenience, and thanks for your help. Come on, JJ. How's that, Mikey? Hmm, what do you mean? If these animals don't exist, then whose claws were they? That was really weird. Yeah. I don't know who it could be. Hmm. I think we should go back to the crime scene. I agree. Back to the scene of the crime. Okay, JJ. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Stop. Can you put the pedal to the floor, JJ? I'm going as fast as I can. Oh, we're here. So here we are. Yes. Let's go think about what you and I have overlooked. Yes, officer. Look at everything without missing a speck of dust. I'm not letting a single hair out of my sight. So we're back on the scene. JJ, look, TV woman's body's gone. Where could the body have gone? What happened here? <gasps> hey, JJ, I found something here. What's in there? Somebody ripped the yellow tape. Ah, uh, how could they do that to the holy yellow ribbon? Yeah, I think we should follow the candy floss trail. Oh, Mikey, stop making jokes. Hee hee hee. In situations like this, you gotta laugh, JJ. Oh my god. Oh, look. More evidence? There's something else in here. It's a regular gray wolf. You can see this wolf has been tortured very badly. I agree. He looks deplorable. What else is there? Cool black sunglasses. Wow. I'd like to keep this too. It'll come in handy. And jaws with sharp teeth. Oh, I don't need that. Oh, hmm. I mean, do you know what that means? Yeah, that was definitely not an animal. Yeah, what are we gonna do? I think we should go back to the police station and look at the CCTV. Huh. Yeah, hurry up, JJ. There's a criminal on the loose. We've got to stop him before he does any more crime. Two hours later. 
Phew, we're here. Yeah. Our office is close. Hurry up, JJ. Look out. Mikey's assistant is about to solve a crime. Huh, what? Enter the code, please. Huh. You're on the verge of solving a crime and you're stopped by a door code. I don't have the right rank. You know that. Yeah, yeah, Mikey. I know that. I'm sorry. So do you remember which camera we should switch on? Check out camera number eight, Ninth Street. Hmm. Listen, I think it was in the other street. You don't trust me? All right. All right. Calm down. I'm going to look at it. Okay, let's go. Okay, here's today's entry. Whoa, what is that? This is weird. What are those iron tentacles? Okay, wait, let's take a closer look at it. Hmm, interesting, interesting. What a long test. <gasps> That's it. I knew it was your favorite Skibidi toilets. Got anything to say for yourself? Wow, I told you they had great music, but they're still bad guys. Hmm. Let's stop them, JJ. Okay, let's go. Hurry up, hurry up, I'm feeling energized. Wow, you're really shining. Let's get help. Yeah, let's get help from the chief. He'll know exactly what to do. Okay, okay. Warden, hey. Chief, open the door. Open up, we need help. Guys, why are you making so much noise? Uh... Come into the office and tell me calmly what's going on. We've solved the case where the TV woman was attacked by a Skibidi octopus. It's true. We've come to you for help. What do you say, Chief? I'll tell you it's an emergency. Oh! We need to storm the Skibidi toilet base now. We will gather all our armed forces. You guys are good. Thank you, Warden. And you, Mikey, get a promotion. Oh, really? Wow, Mikey. Yes, really. You heard that, JJ. Of course. I'm an officer now, too. Hurry up! Hey, you horrible skibbity toilets. Thanks to your fellow man, you will be subjected to an assault. They Surrender certainly yourselves won't want to give up. We will use all our might. Yes, they are definitely finished. So, no matter how hard I try to get through to them, they won't give up. I can see that. Which means we're gonna blow up the entire front of this building. Cool! Your job is to get in there and take out their entire group. Arm yourself, Mikey. We're going in. My weapons are ready. Good luck. JJ, this is our first full-fledged solo mission. We need to do it perfectly. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go, JJ. Attack! Wow! Wow, that's what I call firepower. That was awesome. You weren't expecting it, but we're here. Look out! Come at me if you've got the stomach for it. Mikey, they got me pinned down. Help me. JJ, are you okay? Yeah, come on. Let's get rid of the others. Okay, let's go. Ouch. One of them's acting like a rat. Oh, is there anyone else? We've cleared this place. Are you sure there's no one else? There doesn't seem to be anyone else around. Yay, that was too easy. I didn't even break a sweat. That was incredible. You were unbelievable, JJ. Yeah, I was up against an army of toilets. I think so, too. I think we should go out back, because we still haven't found the octopus toilet. Let's go to the backyard. Oh, my God. There it is. Yeah. Mikey, I think this is our chance to prove ourselves. And we should take that chance. Show of hands, Skibidi Toilet Octopus. You're under arrest. Do you remember when you burst in and you were like, attack if you dare? Yeah! That sounded mega cool. Really? And I was good looking too. Wow, Mikey. Good afternoon, boys. Hello, Chief. You did a great job with the Skibidi toilet base. That's why the brass has decided to give you a big reward. <gasps> You're guaranteed a bonus. Cool! You should have enough diamonds to last you a long time. Yeah, I'm getting myself a new private car. And you're also being given a new rank. Oh! Well done, I'm proud of all Thank of you. Thank you, Chief. Thank you so much. I gotta go, bye. Goodbye. Bye. Mikey, this is just unbelievable news. I'm just shocked. I had no idea we'd actually get an award. The next day. Look where I've gotten myself into. You, JJ, will never get in here. You're too much of a coward. Stop showing off. Get down and let's go play something else. Okay, okay. So what are we gonna play? There's tons of stuff we can play before the parents get here. Let's try everything. Nice. Uh, no, we won't make it. Children, come here. Let's go home. It's time for us to go home. Let's go, JJ. That's what I thought. We didn't finish the game. Hi, Mom. Hey, guys. So, how was the playground? How did you play? Did you enjoy it? A nice playground has finally been built. We would have had time to play everything if it weren't for Mikey. What happened? JJ, just chickens out. I thought something was wrong. Come on, let's go home. We have to go. Let's stay here some more. Mikey and I haven't had enough. No, JJ, we're very tired. Let's go home and eat. Ha 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 ha. They think they're doing well in life. I have a plan to disrupt their lives. Their dad will be less tired in prison. Enjoy your dinner, kids. Did you like it all? It was great, Mom. Yeah. I'm very happy. Okay, guys, it's time to go to bed. Tomorrow's a big day. We need to get some sleep. Oh, what? Look at the time, JJ. You should be asleep by now. Wow, let's go to bed then. Let's go. That's great. Then let's not be long and go to your room. We'll take you to bed. Come on, Mikey. Let's not waste time. Let's go, JJ. I'll be the first one in our room. You just want to play around. You can go first. I'll be in bed, too. Let's calm down and go to bed. Come on, kids. Get down. Your daddy and I want to go to bed, too. All right. We're on our way. Let's go. Let's go. That's it. I'm here. I'm on the bed. Good night, Mikey. Sleep tight. Good night, Mikey. Good night to you, too. Good night, JJ. 
See you tomorrow morning. Good night, JJ. And good night to you, Mom and Dad. Get some rest. We'll wake you up tomorrow. Let's go to bed already. Bye. Just get some sleep. Don't talk, don't play. You need to be strong for tomorrow. Of course we'll be resting. We get it. Go to bed already. Okay, we're leaving. Goodbye. See you soon. Good night, Mikey. I'm already sleepy. I'm falling asleep too. I'm so tired today. I agree with you completely. It's getting pretty dark already. I need to get home soon before someone attacks me. It's so nice at night though, it's warm. Come here, civilian, I need to talk to you. What, what is it? Oh my God, who are you, what do you want? You can't know who I am. Come here and give me all your money. Otherwise it'll end badly. No, please don't touch me, please. The next day. Bye, see you tonight. Beautiful morning, beautiful weather. It's so nice when everything is beautiful. Time to go to work in a good mood? Gotta make more money today. That's what people say. If you sleep well, the day starts with a good mood. And how could it be without a delicious breakfast? Wait, stop. I need to talk. It won't take long, don't worry. I have a gift for you. What gift? Who are you? What do you want? Don't worry about it. It's just a gift. Consider yourself lucky today. Today's your day. Here you go. All this money is yours. You can have it. Use it however you want. Just be careful with it, even though it's a joke, never mind. Ha <laughs> ha. What? Why are you giving me money for nothing? What did I do? You gave me so much money for no reason. Why don't I just take them and not think about why I got them for free? That amount of money can't be passed up. I don't even want to think about that, man. I'd rather take it and buy presents for my family. It's rare to get this much money for free, so we should take advantage of this opportunity. What are we gonna do today? Maybe go for a walk? We can go back to that site where you were yesterday and walk around there longer. That's a great idea, Mom. All right, then let's go get ready. Let's go. What? Why is Daddy back so early? Guys, I have a surprise. Let's go get ready and go buy you anything you want. We'll go and get you some new toys and your mom some new clothes. What? What happened? I was given a little gift. Now I have a lot of money so I can buy anything. Wow, cool. Let's go get ready. No way. Thank you. Kids, go to your room and get ready. Let's go, Mikey. Wow, that's great. And think about what should I buy. Go think in your room, but hurry up. I can't wait to go to the store. Hurry up, hurry up. Let's go, JJ. We have to get everything done. I have so many ideas of what we should buy. Since Daddy can afford to let us have a party today, let's not be petty. What's on your mind, JJ? What should we get at the store? I'm going to ask my dad for a new TV and more new toys. Great, JJ, and I'll ask my dad for some new and interesting books. Did you think it through? Of course I thought well. I've already read all of them. I can't get enough of new books. Show of hands. Did you hear that, Mikey? What's going on out there? Yeah, I heard. Looks like the police broke into our house. Oh my god. What's going on in there? We gotta run and see what's going on. Get down on the floor now. Hear that? Of course I did. Let's hurry up. It looks like one of our parents got caught. You are detained on suspicion of assault and theft of property against a civilian. Did you rob someone? What's going on here? What are you in there with him for? Somebody tell me what's going on. Mom, do you know what happened? I don't understand anything. It's a mistake. Let him go, please. He didn't do anything. Yeah, of course he didn't do anything. He's going down for a long time for stealing from a man. It's kind of crazy. We're here. This is where he lives. He's already been apprehended. That's great. Let's go tell me if it's him. Who the hell is that guy? Did this man steal from you? Yes, it's definitely him. He's the one who came up to me at night and stole from me. Policeman, explain to me what's going on. Yes, of course. Your father robbed this civilian last night and took all the money. Wait, what? But sir, he was home last night. There's a witness here who saw his face last night. Yes, I remember his face exactly. It was him. Let's check what's in his pockets. You have no right to search me. Don't touch me. You're so busted. Here's your money. Oh my god! He brought them today. He said it was a gift. Of course it's a gift, liar. Calm down. Hold your money. You can be free. Thank you, officer. Holy cow, all the money's here. Well, thank you. I'm going to go home. Guys, don't worry so much. My dad's not a thief. You've made a mistake. He couldn't. I realize this is a shock to you all, but we have to get him. Wait, where? Our father's going to jail? Get this criminal carefully into the car. This speaker man will get what he deserves. We'll get it done, sir. You will be punished for your evil deeds. No trick. Dad, tell them it's not true. JJ, I don't have a choice. They won't believe me anyway. Uh, but you know, I sure as hell didn't steal the money. Mikey, did you hear that? All right, we're out of here. Daddy, don't go. We're coming with no, you. No, 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 no. You guys can't come with us. He's a dangerous criminal. Move it. Family, forgive me. Farewell. Huh, what? He's got a lot of crimes on his record, so forget about him. Mom, do something about this situation. Where are you taking him? We're taking him to the police station for processing. Oh my god. Thanks for the warm welcome. Goodbye. You all took our father, and now you're making jokes. Mom! Hey! And Mikey! What are we gonna do? Oh, JJ, I think the cop is right. Wait, what? He was identified by a resident, and they found money in his pocket. I don't know what to do. Yes, Mom, the evidence adds up. Maybe you're right. <laughs> I can't believe
believe our dad would do such a thing. <laughs> Go to your room, both JJ, of you. JJ, this can't be happening. Uh, our dad's the kindest dad in the world. I don't believe it. Mikey, you need to calm down. I don't want to calm down. You don't understand anything, JJ. <laughs> <laughs> Viewers, am I missing something? Write in the comments, is our dad good or bad? Now I gotta go get Mikey and try to calm him down. Mikey, where are you? Mikey? <laughs> Why did this happen? Dad, I miss you already. <laughs> oh my god. Three hours later. How could he do such a thing? He's a good man. Oh my god. He's my dear husband. Who's gonna raise the kids? Who's gonna go to work? I can't live like this. Yeah, it's all too sad. I don't know what we're gonna do without dad. You're right, JJ. I don't even wanna play. I know what you mean. We don't wanna have any fun with this kind of grief. It's not our father's fault. He's a good man. He would never cheat or rob anyone. He must have been set up. Yeah, you're right, Mikey. I think so, too. Our father is a role model for all of us. I won't say he's a saint, but at least he's a good one. He couldn't have done this. We're gonna find out who set him up. Then we'll tell the police who did these crimes. But how do we prove it? The crimes took place on the street. We can look at the security footage and see who did them. Mikey, you're a genius. Just how do you have access to the cameras on the street? It's simple, JJ. I just hacked into the surveillance system. Mikey, I didn't realize you knew so much about computers. Whoa, JJ, I found the very same security footage. This is unbelievable. What did it get on? You're going to really like this. Let's take a look at them. Well, let's take a look. Hey, you! Give me all your money right now. If you don't, you'll regret it. Money on the barrel. Now! What? My money? I'm not giving you any Anything. Then get it! Ow! You stupid citizen! You stupid idiot! Hey, man, what's up? Uh, it's okay. You want money? Get it! I'm generous today! Is that for me? Really? Take as much as you want! Oh, that's so nice of you. Yeah, sure! Take it! Don't be shy! Treat yourself right! Ha 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 ha! It's all a bit suspicious, but why not? I'll take the money. Maybe I should spend that money on my family. Buy them all kinds of goodies and fun stuff. Oh my god, Mikey! The Skibidi toilet did it all! Yeah, JJ! He framed our dad! He did it on purpose! Now we show all these tapes to the police and they'll release dad? Dad? Yeah, that's what we wanted. They'll realize he's innocent, and they'll find the toilet skibidi and put him in jail in his daddy's place. Our daddy will come back. Yeah, we'll show the cop that camera disc, and he'll realize how wrong they were. By the way, we should tell mom about this. Yeah, JJ, you're right. Mom's going to the police with us. I don't think the cops are going to talk to little kids like us. I hate that we're being disadvantaged because of our small age. Oh, mommy's still sad about daddy. We should cheer her up. Mom, we have good news for you. What happened? Our dad's innocent. He was framed. He didn't commit a crime. Uh, what? How did you know about that? We looked at the footage from the cameras on the street. The skibbity toilet did it all. Oh my god, are you serious? Yes, we have a CD of the recordings. Records? That's so cool. So my husband's not guilty of any crime. We can show them to the police. Of course we can. Hurry up and go to the police station. We have to get our daddy out as soon as possible. You are so good for both of you. You hear that, Mikey? We're good. You guys are just the best. I thought my husband was really a criminal, but you were able to talk some sense into me again. Yeah, I'm the best. I hacked the cameras. I made the tapes. Yeah, Mikey. Let's go to the police and show them everything. Children, let's go quickly. We can't wait a minute while our dad's in jail. You see, I did a better investigation than those stupid cops. You're the best, Mikey. By the way, it's very strange. Why didn't they look at the security footage themselves? I don't know. They're really bad at their job. Now we're going to show them they're incompetent. Yeah, they're pretty stupid. Just don't say it to their face, okay? Okay, or they'll put us in jail too. Is that possible? Going to jail for insults? JJ, they can put you in jail for anything. Okay, kids. We need to find an officer and talk to him. He usually sits in the room on the right. No, JJ. It's in this room on the left. I'm sure of it. I'm sorry. May I come in? I have an urgent matter. Yeah, come on in. I'm listening. Hey, kids. Hi, I missed you guys. So what brings you here? Another crime? Talk to me. Your crime? You put dad in jail without evidence. Here it is. Yeah, our dad was framed. You didn't look at the security footage. Cameras? We forgot all about them. Give me the disc. I'm going to investigate. Oh, and now you wanted to see them. Okay, here you go. Get them in here already. I can't wait to see it. Awesome. Goodbye to the life of a thief. Hello, free world. Yes, the inmates are starting to speak the language of the prison. Hopefully this will pass soon. So, let's see what you've brought here. Oh my god, Skibidi Toilet? He was robbing passersby? Daddy is innocent. That's horrible. We put an innocent man in jail. I apologize for our incompetence. Yeah, you guys really screwed up. We will release your father from detention right now. They're going to set him free. I'm so excited. I won't have to eat bread and water anymore. Should I open the door? Open it up already. Okay, okay, don't yell at me. Yee-hoo! Daddy's out of jail, finally. My dear family, thank you for getting me out of here. I'm very grateful to you. Daddy's not a criminal. We're so happy. We are all very happy. What are you going to do with the real criminal? We're gonna take him to jail. I gave the order for his arrest. Wow, now that's real justice. Catch him quickly. You're all doing a 
great job. I thought you'd forgotten me long ago. How could we forget you? We all love you together. You're our father. We love and appreciate you. Oh, that's so cute. I love you too. And who came up with the idea of looking at camera footage? Oh, I did that. Mikey, you're a genius. Thank you. Let's just go home and watch cartoons. I don't want to stay at the police station much longer. Okay, let's just go home. I don't like being here either. You know, I'll never take money from strangers on the street again. There's no way it'll be another setup from another bad guy. Yeah, looks like Daddy learned his lesson. He won't do it again. Oh, look, that's Gabidi Toilet. He's already been arrested. Yeah, guys, I didn't do any of this. I was set up. God, he's so mean. He says he's being set up. He can talk, but he can't do anything against the evidence from the cameras. Yeah, he's definitely going to jail. He's so good at lying. I think we'll see him again soon. I hope that doesn't happen. Yeah, and his plan is bad. He just put on a speaker's mask when he's a toilet and he's human. How could anyone believe him? Trust me, I'm not a criminal. Yeah, he'll do anything to make sure his lies are believed. Come on, let's go home. We've got a lot to do while Daddy's away. Yeah, there's a new season of my favorite cartoon that I never finished watching. Whoa, cartoons? I miss them so much. They didn't have a good TV in prison. Our dad is definitely not a criminal. That's right. When someone's watching cartoons, someone's mugging people on the street. We'll never be as mean as that skibidi toilet. No, we won't. Maybe just a little bit. Just a little bit? Yeah, a little bit. I think it'll make life more fun. Everything in proportion, Mikey. Friends, thank you so much for watching this video. By the way, subscribe to the Minas channel. Have you ever been set up by other people? Write about it in the comments. Be good, guys. Don't set anyone up. We love you all very much. Bye-bye. Bye, everybody.